Hey, what's going on? Zach Hample here with a pretty simple video for you guys today. And I'm excited because I'm gonna be using this to open this. You can see I have a few baseball gloves here and I'm looking forward to adding another one to my collection and showing you guys what it looks like. So let's get right down to it, shall we? Um, I will say that in the last year or two, I did film a video about my baseball glove collection. You can see that thumbnail right up here on the screen. So check that one out. I'll link to it in the description. In that video, I had eight baseball gloves. And this one that I'm opening up here in the box is actually my 10th glove. So the last two gloves that I've acquired, including this one, are both buckler gloves. This is the old new one. I was using this for the second half of last season, the 2021 season. And the new one actually looks pretty much just like it, or so I was told, but it's gonna be custom. So check it out. Here is the inside of the box. We'll pull this out and nothing there. So let's see what this baby looks like. All right, so nice. First things first, we have some packing materials. We don't need those. Looks like there's kind of a bag, like a drawstring bag with the buckler logo on it. That's cool to put the glove in. But the glove itself, check it out. And I said this thing is a custom glove. Well, there is my name right on the thumb. That's pretty cool. So just to, to show you what these two gloves look like side by side, I mean, they're, they're twins, but we got the custom glove and the non-custom glove. So, you know, I'm gonna switch over to this one for this season. Um, basically the same other than that, there might be just a few slight differences. Like you can see what's branded on the palm of the glove. That's the old one and that's the new one. So slight differences there, but yeah, basically the same glove, same size, 11 and a half inches. Um, oh, and it even says, can you see that custom built right there? So if you're wondering why I'm using a small glove, I mean, this is an infielder's glove. Well, I grew up playing shortstop my whole life. And yeah, when I'm at major league stadiums, running around in the seats, trying to catch home runs, it's fly balls. So wouldn't an outfielder's glove be better? Yes, technically the extra, you know, little bit of leather could help when baseballs are just flying right above my glove. But listen, once a shortstop, always a shortstop. I just feel more comfortable with smaller gloves. So, you know, if I miss a baseball by an inch or two, you know what that means? I need to jump higher. It doesn't mean I need a bigger glove. I don't know, maybe that makes no sense. But yeah, this is the glove. Um, I'll be using this mallet quite a bit in the coming weeks and months to break it in and hopefully not break my hand in the process. But yeah, this thing looks sweet. And by the way, just so there is no confusion and no false accusations swirling about, Buckler is not paying me to do this video. They did send me this glove for free and I really did like it. And they offered to send me another glove and I was like, how about a custom glove? So yeah, they, they did send this to me for free, but again, there's no, there's no money exchanging hands here. They did not ask me to do a video. I'm just doing this because I like the glove. And I mean, who doesn't like unboxing videos and baseball gloves? It's a baseball channel. So uh, big thank you to Buckler. You guys should check them out. At Buckler Sports on Insta. I'll link to their website and other stuff in the description. And yeah, I mean, that's, that's pretty much it. I'm really excited to break this in and use it. And hopefully we have a full major league season in 2022 with all this lockout nonsense. I think they are going to resolve it, but maybe lose some spring training games. That's my prediction. What about you guys? Anyway, um, that's all I got. Thanks for watching. And let's close this out with a little natural light. 
and more glove smacks.